Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Monday the 5th of June 2023. I hope you are keeping well. I'm having a lazy day here in Bangkok. It's another public holiday. If you are going to ask the question, didn't you just have a public holiday and haven't you had a lot of public holidays this year so far? And the answer is yes, yes, and yes. Uh, <laughs> that's one advantage of living in Thailand. We get a lot of public holidays, although to be honest, uh, many companies don't provide a lot of uh, annual leave. Um, or that, uh, international companies do, but um, the local companies often don't. And so it's a way of protecting, giving people days off, I think, uh, if you're working for a local company. Um, I like it when I find new words. Uh, I just had to look up the word Zorb. Uh, I looked it up on the internet. Um, because of a story in the Guardian saying uh, a boy was in a zorb that floated off in the in a gust of wind, and I thought, what on earth are they talking about? It said a transparent bubble, so I thought, what on earth could that be? I have no idea what it is. I've never seen one before in my life, but fortunately, we have the internet, and so we have instant access to the whole world of information. Right, that's the greatest thing about the internet is being able to find immediate answers to things that you don't know. Um, with or without chat GPT, just, you know, just general, just generally being able to find pictures of things. And when I saw a picture, I went, oh, really? I, I still, I still, I'm still intrigued as to what it might be. I guess it's a game or something. But um, anyway, I now know what a Zorb is. Uh, and I, I'd only heard of Zorba the Great. Zorba the Greek, wasn't it, before that? <laughs> Excuse me. Um, right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku. This is our uh, New York Times hard-level game for Monday. Uh, okay, I will begin with uh, six in this square because of the sixes blocking across here. Excuse me. Six is blocking across here, six blocking there, and six blocking there. So in that row, I think we'll place the six in that location. We have a five across here and a five up there, so we'll get five there. Try to get, okay, we've got four across here and across here and another one down there. So the four going up and the four going down and the four in the middle. Uh, okay, we have, I don't know if it means anything, 6, 8 blocking down here and 6, 8 blocking across here. So we have 6 and 8 in those squares. Uh, so we'll be left with 2 and 3 in these squares. It certainly does mean something. 3 blocks across here, that will be the 3. And that will be our 2.
we have uh, seven across here and seven down here and seven across here. Those are black numbers and these are all black. So I guess that one's been there since the beginning. So you've probably been screaming at me to get it. Well, I've got it now. Thank you. Uh, okay, so definitely got something up here. We've got one, four, oh, yeah, am I dreaming? I'm pretty sure I've got some, okay, let's work this out again, sorry. We've got uh, here and here, two and nine, all right. Um, and we've got twos down here. We've got nines here. Yeah, two nine, okay. Uh, right, now what I think I worked out is I've got fours blocking up here like this, so I've got fours there. I've got ones blocking up there, so I've got ones there. And, oh, no, maybe I'm wrong. Well, I might be wrong, I am wrong, I think. Cancel that idea, just proof that I play these games live, that's all. Uh, oh no, keep thinking I'm about to, f I think keep, I keep thinking I've seen something and it turns out to not be true. Let's click on the digits and see if I can go any further with these. I think I'll click on what I know because the blue sometimes helps me. Ah, three five. Three five spotted it. See, helping it helps when you click on the blue, it often helps. Three five in those squares there. Ah, so now we've got the seven blocking across here. That means that that is a seven, doesn't it? Uh, and we've got sevens going across to the end here and a seven up there. So we'll also get a seven in that square. Uh, and we have seven blocking this square, seven blocking this square, seven blocking here and seven blocking there. So let's place a seven there. Back down here, this was three and five. 
Uh, and so here and here we are looking for, well, okay, what was missing here? Six, eight, six, eight. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, can't tell which is which yet, yeah, but across here we've got three, five here. So here we're looking for one, four, nine, and we've got one and four in the same column. So that's got to be our nine. Uh, here we are looking for nine and nine and what? Uh, I can't find you. Nine and one. We've got three up here now across these rows, giving us a three there. And three and two blocking down here. So this is a pair of two and three here now. And so this has to be eight and nine. So this can't be eight. That's got to be eight. And then this will be our six. And... Eight blocks across like this and this, so that would be an eight there. Right, we have four up here and up here and across here, so that will give us a four in that square. And this was eight and nine, so this has got to be one. We have four across here and four across here. That puts the four into that square. Oops, four down here, four across here. There's another four we can place. One across here gives us a one in that square. One all the way to the bottom like this and across here will give us a one there. Uh, I'm going to go back to digit clicking again. Or maybe I'm just going to look at this for the moment. Okay, let's see what we've got. Five and nine in those squares. Ones I can't do anything about. Uh, six. Yeah, we got a pair of sixes like this. Sixes. 
sevens. Mm. Hmm, tough. I am going to go back to digit clicking. And a bit more blue as well, just to in case I spot anything. Uh, those are the blue patterns for one. Ah. No, wait, why did I put that? That's not right, is it? That's not true. Silly me. No, 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 that's not true at all. Twos are like this. Almost made a mistake there. Almost fluked it. Uh, not much there. Uh, no restrictions on five up there. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay, we've got nine uh, limited to these squares here. Okay, let us uh, let me prove it. We've got nine blocking up here, nine blocking up here. So here we have nine only in the top row or the bottom row of this shoot, right? So that means that nines are in those squares. Or you could just look along here and see nines are missing from here. Now we have nine blocking across here like this. Okay, which means that nine is in one of those squares there. So we can only look for nine in these two squares here. Let me just highlight it. And we can see nine blocking here, nine blocking here. So we know that that has to be our nine. Thank goodness.
And now we see one blocking here, one blocking here. So we know that in fact is our digit one. And we have seven going up here and seven going up here gives us a seven in that square, seven across here, seven up and up here puts the seven, finishes off the seven actually. Now we can come down here and say this is an eight, I think to finish this column. And we have the eight down here and down there, across there and down there, I should say, that gives me eight here, eight this way, that way, as an eight. Um, eight up here and eight across here means that's an eight. And eight up, up and away, super eight goes there. Right, now we know this was five and nine, so the missing number here is six six blocks down here and across here here's a six uh where else we've got six blocking up here and across there so that's the final digit six one number missing here it's a two um one number missing down here that looks, no, I was going to say an eight, but it's not an eight, is it? Um, <laughs> just twiddle your thumbs while I look and find the missing number. It's a nine, isn't it? Okay. Um, right, so not much more to go. Um, we've got five blocking up here. That puts a five into that square. Five blocks here. We need a five in this column. It goes there. Five across these two rows gives us a five there. Five up here puts the five into that square. This is a nine. Nine blocks down here, putting the nine into that square we need a nine to complete this column now we have the nine blocking across here that gives us a nine there nine down here nine across here there's a nine we can place and uh, not much more to go now there we go there's one missing digit up here is it a two I think it is. Uh, one number missing over here. I think it's a one. So one block's down here, one block's across here. Here's the digit one. The last number for this column is three. Three blocks across here. Here's a three. Three blocks up here. Here's another three. And uh, three blocking across here gives us a three there. We're looking for a two in this square here. We need a two in those squares there and a two blocking up puts the two there and we can finish with five here and a five there. That's our New York Times hard level game for Monday. See you around and uh, relax if you're on holiday in Thailand. Bye bye.